Battleship the Game. It's a game based on a movie which is loosely based on a board game. That's just insane. I mean, what if they decided to make like a blockbuster movie out of this? Would they have another game based on this game which was based on a movie which was based on a board game? Truthfully, the only thing this movie has in common with the source material is that there is a battleship in it. I have a suspicion that the film studio had this Aliens vs. the Navy script and just tacked it onto the battleship license to get a little publicity for it. Anyways, you might have seen the commercials for this game. A first person shooter where you just blow aliens to hell. And it looks awesome! Oh yeah, about that. You see, that was only the Xbox and PS3 versions. They went a different route with the Wii. So they made a turn-based strategy game. Kudos to the creators for actually trying to make a title based on the board game. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of strategy games. I find them a bit boring at times. However, this game did a good job of keeping it somewhat interesting. Just like the movie, they have your characters trapped in a part of the ocean, which has been cut off from the rest of the world by a force field put up by the aliens that have invaded. So the other ships that are trapped inside this dome force field decide to take on the alien force and save the day. Basically what you're going to do in this title is that you're going to go up against any alien ships that you come across and you're going to need to go to ports in order to rearm and get new ships. Now each level is designed like a chapter which will advance the story. Now this game kind of feels like a ported DS game as the graphics were far from impressive. They could have easily improved on the graphics as they were not even close to what the Wii could push out. Even worse was the cutscenes that played out every time you did a turn. They would show you firing your weapon or shooting off a missile at the enemy. And while that may sound cool in theory, it came off so cheesy. Thank goodness they were all skippable. The whole ocean is like one big board that you can move your ships around in. You get multiple turns per round, but you can only move a ship once per turn. After that, it's out of play until the next round. I found it a bit frustrating when the enemy ships would appear from under with the water. I get it that it's part of the challenge of the game, but for a game about strategy, it's hard to come up with one when they randomly appear on the board. So what you're going to need to do is have a few random ships nearby the edges in case one of them pops up that you need to take care of. Each of the ships had different ranges that they can move on the playing board. Some have better weapons or some could just take an assault better on their ship. You would need to be smart on which ship you send into what area. It did get very repetitive as it was pretty much all the same. Some of the more cooler parts was when you went into a first person mode and they had you take out specific parts of the alien ship. There were also special attacks that you could do, which I was at times confused on even what they did because they really didn't give you quite a very good indication what the special attacks do. There are 26 missions with increasing difficulty levels. Okay, okay, well obviously on that statement. No, it gets easier. Of course it gets harder. Once you complete one mission, you can play that mission again anytime you want in the main menu. Now I don't want to sound like I'm too negative on the game. It wasn't that bad. It just felt totally out of place for the Wii. There was nothing in it that screamed, yeah, we built this for the Wii. No, it screamed, yeah, this is definitely a DS game. Battleship the game was alright. As a guy who really doesn't like this type of game, it kept my interest for a lot longer than I was expecting. If you're a fan of these type of strategy games, you might find some fun in this, but I think you should just rent it.